to y'all sent mail. Oh my goodness, I have five pieces of mail to open today. Can you believe it? I went to the post box and there was like three there in one day and I already had two, so I'm so excited. So I'm gonna be starting here. I don't even know which order I received them in, so I'm just gonna pick one and open it. Uh, this is from Samantha and Samantha lives in Georgia. So, uh, yay, Samantha, we're, we're kind of we're kind of neighbors, aren't we? <laughs> so anyway, uh, very pink envelope, very pretty. Let's see what it says. It may be, I, I don't even know, it may be Easter. I don't think I had it before Easter, I'm not sure. <laughs> Look, it's a piece of toast. Oh my goodness, it's got a little smiley face in it. Oh, that is just too stinking cute. Uh, a toast to you on Mother's Day. Oh, Samantha, thank you so much. This is perfect timing, wow. So a Mother's Day card from Samantha, so very cute. Love the toast, that kind of, that smiley, the smile and the two eyes look like chocolate. <laughs> Samantha, that is so sweet of you. Thank you so much. My first Mother's Day card this year. Oh, I said I'm gonna set that right back there so um, everyone can see it. So Samantha, thank you again. All right, now this one, I do not know who it's from because there's not a, a name up here, but maybe on the inside, it will tell me. <laughs> All righty, now this is from, I don't know. Uh, I don't even know who it's from, but it's a track. Mama's Girl from Chicks Publications. I've read, read many of these, so Whoever this is from, uh, somebody in Florida. So thank you so very much, whoever you are. There's no name. I don't think it's signed anywhere. No, well, I wish I knew who that was from. But anyway, thank you guys so much for that. Okay, I'm gonna open this one. This is from Jamie. Heard from Jamie many times before. And let's see here what Jamie has to say. All right that over there. I got a return envelope. Uh, let's see, Jamie is from, where's Jamie from? Oregon, Oregon. <laughs> you do a little person for looking at Oh my stars written right there. Dearly in this kitchen, I'm on your YouTube live streams every Sunday. I am Jamie on YouTube. I am Betty White. I am not a girl. I am a guy. Yes, Jamie, you've told me that every time. <laughs> How's Chad, your son, doing these days? This goes out to you right now uh, from Jamie. P.S. Write me back soon. <laughs> so cute. I'm loving this. Oh, my stars. So anyway, thank you, Jamie, for your letter. That's so very sweet of you. I just sent me a letter. I just love hearing from uh, from you, you're just too sweet. Okay, now this one right here is kind of puffy. Uh, it says from Angela. Angela is from Angela is from Australia. Oh, oh my goodness! I don't know if I've ever gotten anything from Australia. I'm gonna cover this up. But look, she wrote stars <laughs> and a heart. She drew it on the back of the envelope. So this is so cool. I love it. I love it. <laughs> Okay, this was kind of puffy, like I said, so. All right, let's see, oh my goodness, what in, oh! Oh my goodness, okay. Ha, okay, I'm gonna show that in just a minute. First, I'm gonna read your letter, because it's Easter, and I didn't think I had this this long. No, I haven't, I must have just got it a little late. Dearly to happy Easter. I found this little purse in a local store, and Tink was, so sulky in the image that I had to get it for you. It's a little token of appreciation for sharing your life and talents with us. It's a blessing to see. Keep it up, I'll be cheering you on. Hugs, Angela. That is so precious, Angela, but look at the lol paper she put this on, but look at the Tinkerbell. Oh my, I want this. Yeah, sometimes this is my attitude. <laughs> All right, oh, the charm is a star. How perfect is that? Oh, my, oh, wait a minute, is there another one? No, no, that's just the, oh wait, yeah, oh, it says Disney on it. Oh, I love this, this is so cute. This is gonna be great to keep all my change in, but look at her. Oh, 
Don't y'all have that attitude sometime? Just like, yeah. <laughs> Angela, thank you so much. That is so sweet of you. And I love, love this little purse. Um, it's perfect, perfect, perfect. Well, thank you so much for that. <laughs> so cute. Okay. All right. I have one more. Now this is from Ruth, uh, Mama Kate Castle. <laughs> but look at the tape. She likes that phrase, deal with it. You know, deal with it. Deal, deal pickle. <laughs> I asked her anyway, did she put that on there because of um, Penelope liking pickles? But she said, no, that was a coincidence because um, she likes that phrase, deal with it. <laughs> okay. So like I said, I've heard from Ruth before. She is the one who um, made me the little bit of everything Barbie. Oh my goodness. All right, oh my goodness. She has got this thing full of stuff again. Okay, so <laughs> a chocolate cream egg from Cadbury's. Ah, I love these. And then some uh, Hanky's little tissues with tulips. I said that's just so precious that I, I put these little things in my purse because I always need a tissue, right? Everybody needs a tissue. Let, oh, was I supposed to do me first? What? Oh, wait a minute. You can read it all on camera. Oh, <laughs> oh my God, this is a lot. It's just in a card. And, and what's this one? What is this one? Okay. I'm just gonna, oh my goodness, there's so much here. Okay, dear Lita, thought I'd send you some snail mail. I don't think I told you in my last letter, but I have, I don't know this word, dysgraphia, which I'm not sure what, if I said that right, which makes my handwriting pretty illegible, which is why I type them out. I understand that, but I can read this. I can read that, Ruth. Um, I want to make it easy for you to read and also easy on my right hand writing. I often think that writing out a letter is much more personal. I just decided not to. I wanted to keep us both sane. Yes, thank you. <laughs> wanted to say thanks again for your channel. Been in a big pile of writer's block for a while and was able to combat that by working on a side project from my book called Tight Hallways. I definitely feel like you and Chad inspired me to start writing it. Oh, well thank you. Main character's name is Chris and he's a disabled YouTuber. He married a YouTuber by the name of Lily and they will have a child soon. His mother's name is Lisa. When Chris was a child. Him and a friend climbed to, uh, a tree and his friend accidentally knocked him out of it, causing him to fall and become paralyzed. He makes gaming and toy videos. Since starting tight, tight hallways, I was able to get back into working on my third self-published self book. This one being called Future's Present. I've sent you my first and second one in a box. Yes, yes. And I really hope you enjoy reading them. I know someone asked you in a sunny chat if you liked reading and you said you did. So I can't wait to see what you think. Once you finish Shadows of the Present and Demons of My Past, I've included what I have so far of tight hallways. Oh, thought it would be fun to give the chapter name vlog um, type titles, like someone would name one of their videos for their vlog. This was one that I was not sure if I would publish myself. I just had the idea and had to get it down on paper. That way, if I ever wanted to go back and work again, I just had to reread it. I wouldn't call myself an amazing writer, but my friends think my stuff is pretty good. So if they think it's good, then I'm okay with that. Also, I did not mention it in the first letter, but I made a video showing the process of what I did for the Lita Barbie. It should be uploaded by the time you get this letter. I can send you the link for that one too. I'll mostly likely post that on my Grogan Blogs, uh, is it Grogan channel. If you're interested in watching that, I am. I wanted to wait to upload it so you could have a chance to see the doll and it didn't actually get to you. I just knew that if I uploaded it, it would either pop up on your page or I would be so excited I actually tag you and post it on your page. I was thinking of a better safe, better safe than sorry approach. I wanted to keep the surprise as long as possible. Anyways, I hope you're having a good day and say hi to Greg and Jingles for me. And in the words of Chris, aka Chris Allen Toys, always do fun things. All right. P.S. I've started a new chapter for channel. New. No, I've started a new channel for Joe, my puppet. It's called Roos Puppets Pals. I'm slowly putting up videos on that channel. Also, hopefully you were able to read the letter that came in my book. It might not make sense until you read book three, which is almost done. But when it is, you can get on createspace.com or go to Amazon as an ebook or paper book. I hope you enjoy the books and, I, and have an awesome day. P.S. Now she's written this part. If anyone asks about my books, feel free to spread the word. That way you can say you knew me when. Hi! 
laugh out loud. I love it, Ruth. Thank you so much. All right. I'm going to open this card. It says, yay you. Yay you. <laughs> he wishes you a happy birthday. She wishes you a happy birthday. I wish you a happy birthday. <laughs> My birthday is in June. Uh, heck, we all wish you a happy birthday. <laughs> Ruth and Darwin. Birthday. My birthday is in June, so that will be coming up very, very soon. Oh, so this is um, the new book, Tight Hallways, that she's written. Part I get, I've gotten part of it. So <gasps> I'm so excited to read that, Ruth. Thank you so much. That is so cool. I've never got just like a partial book from a writer when they're in the middle of writing. I mean, isn't that just awesome? Okay, uh, there's one more here. Um, Dear Lita, thank you so much for allowing Ruth to send you the book to read. I really hope you enjoy reading and learning about my life. You know they say life has its ups and downs and it's completely true. I've dealt with so much in my life, which is why I've included the Kleenex. I want you to know that it's okay to cry while reading or really anytime. And, and Ruth, yeah, I do. Uh, if, if It just happens. <laughs> no need to hold in tears. I deal with that a lot in these books with everything that goes on in my family. But I, but don't fret. I've been told that book three is a lot happier. Oh, wait. I do know. I'm in it. <laughs> Anyways, thanks again. I really hope you enjoy reading about my life and meeting my kids and my life partner. He reminded me a lot of Greg, the one person I knew I loved more than anything in the world. I went to spend so much time as I could with him while he was here on earth to love and protect him. Thanks again. Enjoy. Much love. Ruth. Um, P.S. While watching Darlene, my adopted two and a half year old, play with toys she got for her birthday. I was reminded you had one coming up, included a birthday card and a little surprise. Enjoy. Thank you so much, Ruth. That was just so very precious of you. And you really can write. So, I mean, oh my goodness. Okay. So, Ruth and Jamie and Samantha and um, Angela and from someone I don't know because they didn't include their name. Thank you guys so very much for your cards, your letters, your little happies. Oh my goodness, I'm just so excited about all of them. Gonna be putting my change in this little Tinkerbell purse. I just think she's so stinking cute. Um, anyway, y'all, I appreciate it. You're just very precious to me. Um, you just uh, you know, make my heart sing. So anyway, I appreciate y'all watching. I'll see you again next time. Bye now.